respond to a robbery in a mall parking lot. Police say two men targeted two women leaving the Great Lakes Mall Monday morning, getting away with one of the women's purses and with a store's bank deposit. News Channel 5's Paul Kiska spent the day talking with investigators. And Paul, it seems like these robbers knew exactly what they were doing. Well, Danita, police say the men either got lucky, hit the jackpot, or they knew how the store makes its deposits. Great Lakes Mall was just opening for the day early Monday, so police don't believe the men were targeting shoppers. Two women, 20 and 25 years old, who work at the Hollister store, walked out of Great Lakes Mall between Penny's and Macy's. A dirty white SUV was parked next to their car. Two men jumped out of the SUV and threatened the women. Taking their purses, one purse contained the store's deposit bag from a busy Sunday of shopping. Men or police say both men were wearing masks and that the men threatened the women with an eight-inch knife. Displayed a knife. He had a mask on that covered half the, his face. It was just after 9 a.m. Monday. The women were on their way to the bank with the store's deposit bag. Police believe the women are just innocent victims left shaken by the robbery. But they wonder if the men knew how the store operates. Police say the victims did the right thing. Give them your bag. You can. It's just property, money. You can always get that replaced. The store can replace that. Nothing's worth losing your life over something like that. Police believe it's an isolated incident. This shopper agrees. I feel safe. I don't feel like anything's going to happen to me. But um, if something were to happen, I don't know what I would do. All right, so the men, guess what? They got away with those deposits totaling $4,000, plus the women's purses, personal belongings, cell phones, and a camera. Anyone with information is asked to call Mentor Police. In the newsroom, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5. Paul, I have to ask you, is it really wise for a large chain store to use employees to make these bank deposits? Okay, Janita, it's a question I asked mall uh, management. They declined to go on camera, but a mall spokesperson told me some stores uh, have security companies like Brinks that make their deposits for them. Others use employees, but it is up to each store. All right, thank you very much, Paul. Okay.